Welcome back to Ixion. In this episode, the plan is to continue building up this uh, new food sector, as well as tearing down the old food sector, and of course continuing with the uh, science events uh, in the uh, system. Uh, for now, I don't think that I will be using pause very much, uh, at least not until we complete the, um, the science events. After we've completed the science events, uh, that's probably where I'm going to be using pause as uh, I will want to mine up stuff and uh, gather up some science points before we uh, end the chapter. Um, I mean, uh, it's probably a couple of episodes away, but uh, I'm really looking forward to uh, chapter 4. I have not been there yet, neither on this save or the other one. Well, obviously not on this save. But yep, uh, we already are doing uh, progress on the uh, science event, so let's just continue uh, with what we are doing inside of the Tycoon for now. Ice has started to come in here, and we are now getting ice in this sector. So, sector 4, uh, we want to put ice on maximum. Uh, sector 6, uh, they have 100 ice left. Uh, I think we can leave that there for now, but we'll set this... Uh, we'll actually disable trading of ice with Sector 6. I think that's the best option, to not stop the food production here, uh, but at the same time, uh, because we want to empty out this fusion station, because I'm not going to waste that 1,000 water um, into nothing. Population transfer complete. Thank you. Since you can't move water around, uh, that's the reason that I have there. Uh, we can now power on this farm. Just to get this built, we'll power it down again after. We need the uh, ice to come in so the uh, fusion station can start making water. Uh, research points gathered, done, so we can send the light bulb to proc P37. I don't think there's any more um, POIs in the system now. No, that should be it. Uh, let's uh, gather up some more uh, resource uh, points while we continue to uh, build uh, in this sector. I'll leave this stockpile here for a little while because it actually is useful to have a shorter distance rather than having them to drive all the way from up there down here. Uh, we also need another Demotic Quarter. Although it isn't critical just yet. Let's see, uh, I just want to look at the work. Oh my, we have a lot of workers in excess in this sector. Team has completed a task. Uh, in this sector, we are definitely here in excess of workers in the space sector. Yeah, that one is a bit more iffy. Uh, I want to remove this road, and then let's go have a look at the science event. Administrator, a new request awaits your attention. Yeah, that's the Agents of Death. While walking through the tunnel, we activated a trap, presumably left by Etemenanki defense forces. A deluge of debris fell from above, yet fortunately our suit exoskeletons allowed us to avoid fatalities. There was no sign of any Etemenanki survivors, and the end of the tunnel was littered with the corpses of soldiers killed by cutting laser. Exiting the tunnel, we found a, f a small shelter cobbled together from surrounding debris. Within it, a number of broken drones, shaped like deep-sea creatures, float in the lack of gravity. They bear the BMS logo of the Black Market Society. This is the first time we have seen machines like these. We have transmitted schematics and data and propose further analysis of the drones be conducted back on board the Tycoon. Within a small recess at the back of the shelter, we found the corpse of an Etemenanki soldier with a now spent breathing device. They had tried to modify one of the broken drones to produce an improvised heat source. He has been dead for several days. The weak radio signal was transmitting from their suit's emergency beacon. We presume in an attempt to contact other survivors. We get the new event, Agents of Death, and also 77 science here. And then leap the ruins of the Etemenanki. 
we'll want to collect up the signs and then we want to go to the destroyed docking bay after that. Just the final part of the Atemenanki that we have not yet uh, gone through. Okay, we're done with the cargo ship research. Uh, I wish I could give these mining ships speed. That would have been very useful. Um, let's see here. I think we do want the post decolonization treatment. Don't need that as of yet. Don't need that either as of yet. You know, I do want the health center. Let's get the health center. And we're picking up the signs from P37 as well. And that's the final uh, signs we need to pick up. If you're wondering why I'm not using both science ships on the POIs, uh, one of the reasons is the experience points for the, the science ships. Oh, that was funny. Uh, the other reason is I don't want this to get confusing when I read things. I don't want to read two parallel events. Um, so we'll, we'll, we'll stick to one event uh, at a time. And I'm not in a hurry when it comes to... Um, to uh, exploring the events because there is enough things that we have to do in this chapter or some of it is going to be either off camera or while the game is paused. But there's plenty of thing to, things to do uh, so it doesn't really um, make sense for me to, um, to rush. Administrator, we now have enough data to analyze the Pyrenees' drones. The associated research project can be launched in the tech lab. With this, we should be able to install devices that reduce the impact of the Pyrenees' drones on the Tycoon. New technology upgrade. Drone threat analysis upgrade unlocked for the Pyrenees. Here, I want to build, a, not an insect farm, a mess hall. And uh, let's move on to here, just to check the continued to model. Well, we have really a lot of workers in this sector, and we're also full up on alloys. Uh, we don't have enough waste, or alloys is full. That's the problem. A probe has completed its scan. Yeah, we we definitely have enough resources. That's for sure. Uh, okay, we can now power this one off, and we can build another. One. I also want to build trains here. And I also want to increase this to 400. Actually, that's too much. 300. And even that is too much. 260. And you guys may... You gays. Well then. You guys may laugh of me. out of ice here good okay let's continue working on what i am doing in this sector here the next thing we are going to want to do is to let's see i want oh this is going to get very complicated isn't it this road should go up there that gives us eight then one, two, three, four. And then one, two, three. Good. Uh, this road goes away. And now we want to build a demotic quarter here. I'm sure you're all wondering what the heck I'm doing in this sector here, but uh, all in due time, all in due time. I'll get around to it. Uh, we can also launch another probe. And our science ship is done, so let's send the Maxwell to the destroyed docking bay and launch a new probe. I'm trying to find the nearby resource clusters here, so that I can mine these and pick up the cargo from these before we send off the, uh, or move the Tycoon around. We also should monitor our ships here. I think we're full up on... yeah... Okay, we're back to doing that now, are we? Let's stop taking in silicon and... How's that? A yeah. side ship has arrived at its destination. Let's pick up some carbon instead. 
and we have arrived at the destroyed Our docking bay. So uh, let's have a look at what the destroyed docking bay has in uh, in store for us. The information we found in the Yetimenanki's command center has allowed us to locate its docking bay. Transmission from the Maxwell's team. We have arrived on site. This part of the Yetimenanki is a real piece of Swiss cheese. Paradoxically, there is little debris surrounding it. After a rapid survey, we have identified two areas of interest, a still accessible docking port and a communications area. Now, I do believe that these are not uh, exclusive, so let's go ahead and investigate the communications area. Administrator, you can implement a new policy. Uh, how is our happiness here? Plus two. We don't really need to go to restricted here just yet. We do want waste, waste recycling. Um, then enable waste in this stockpile. Uh, maybe even build this one. Could be a good plan. Why you no know have electronics? Because I know have set up electronics import to the sector. A new request awaits your attention. Okay. Administrator, a group of recently awakened survivors from the Etamananki are receiving a cold welcome from the Tycoon crew. Those from the Protagoras have not forgotten how UN forces killed many of their crewmates. So we can either send the crew members from the Etamenanki for psychiatric treatment to ensure their docility. We can s make it so that any employee showing signs of animosity towards another employee will be sent to a care center for psychiatric rehabilitation. Or we can do a little rivalry. Little rivalry never hurt. Um, while I have a, a great understanding for why the people from the Protagoras are upset about this, I think that uh, they will have to learn how to work together here, to be honest. So we are going to do any employee showing signs of animosity towards another employee will be sent to a care center for psychiatric rehabilitation. And how that's going to affect us down the line, I do not know. Why is there no ice coming in here? Have I forgotten to do something? No. Yes, I have. The hydrogen. I don't know when or if we are going to make use of that. But... Yeah. Now, if this electronics part would arrive, that would be very pleasant. So far, it seems that we are only receiving ice, though. Here we go. That should help. An accident has occurred in the tycoon. Of course it has. Here we go. I did set this to max in the sector, yes, 720. Um, we have everything on there. We also have the health center unlocked now. We need bioelectricity on the cell housing to... and also the post decryonization treatment. And I really do want these two. So, cell housing... We need the waste heat recovery on the steel mill for that, so let's go that way then. I think the light bulb is completely dumped, so we can send that back to the tycoon. And I have a lot of notifications to clean up here. And we're done with the ice in this sector, so we can... Uh... Did I set this sector to zero alloys? I'm in sector six. Team has completed a task. 
I did. I did not intend to set it to zero. Or, actually, I did intend to set it to zero. I want them to uh, to export the alloys. Let's see here. The communications room is a theater of atrocities. Frozen, severed body parts float everywhere in a grisly spectacle. The team found that the Etemenanki had implemented a system of non-computerized communication in the battle. The UN crew had discovered that the messages they were sending and receiving via devices and hardware in this area were being tampered with. This falsification of information caused a cascading series of accidents and prompted the move to a new comms system. Something was hacking or mimicking the Etemenanki's communication protocols perfectly. We get 22 signs. Let's investigate the intact docking port next. Uh, yeah, I also trained uh, colonists. Uh, I completely forgot to mention that two episodes back. I did that off camera, so we have 150 of them. I don't know how many colonists we are going to need, but... Um, I also don't remember if I wanted to change this. Yes, I do want to change this. Uh, but we'll get around to that. Okay, uh, the farm is done. Good. Train station done as well? Yes, it is. Can uh, resume constru constructing this one as well. Make it start producing water. Because we need water and not ice. It is a bit interesting to me how they need a fusion station to smelt the ice, though, considering that the ice is already on board the Tycoon. And I would hope that the temperature inside of the Tycoon is uh, above zero degrees Celsius. Otherwise it would be pretty, pretty miserable to be on board here. Now I realize I could pause while we're waiting for this and for the... Um science event to complete, but it would be such a short pause that that's why I'm not doing it. A science ship team has completed a task. This is the Maxwell team. We are stationed by the docking port. It has accumulated a huge mass of debris at the bottom of it. Broken vessels, corpses, damaged cryopods all have been frozen into a horrible amalgam. Ships have entered the port too quickly, crashing inside while attempting to flee. The docking bay came under heavy projectile fire, which tore open the hull and breached the protected plating of the Etemenanki. We have discovered an intact, unexploded BMS missile embedded in the wreckage. We should investigate this further. Now we can either initiate a control detonation of that, we can defuse it, or we can transport it, and we are going to defuse it. The team will attempt to defuse the missile so they can bring it safely back to the Maxwell for analysis. I wish the alloys would come in faster here, but since they have to be transported from all the way over at uh, Sector 2... Uh, the drones are not fast enough. Wine, 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 moan. Okay, now I want to remove the infirmary here. This stockpile we can remove. Same with this stockpile. Also, if I'm importing polymer, let's stop doing that. And while we're at it, let's also build another set of solar panels. 300 and seven electronics yep 
we can temporarily turn on the uh, third EVA airlock for that. We're down, and we want to build another prop farm. Uh, we also also need battery power in this sector, so let's build a large battery there. And this sector has now received boot specialization. Good. A science ship team has completed a task. We have managed to... Mm -hmm. A new request awaits your attention. Thank you, Eden. We have managed to defuse the missile. The technology contained within is not only more advanced than aboard the Tycoon, or even the Yetamenanki, but is of a structure and logic belonging to a completely different scientific paradigm. We have transmitted data and schematics to the Tycoon Tech Lab for further analysis. 16 signs and the event I Missile You. And we the can leave. The electromagnetite has passed through the CRUC system, and the Tycoon is still online. Congratulations, Administrator. Thank you, Eden. It will move even further away. The next planet I want to go to after we are done collecting science here is P41. Uh, I'm wondering if we should build a drone bay in this sector now. Uh, where did we have a, the, uh, this sector here? We have an excess of workers. Uh, from sector 2 to sector 4. Start migration, and since they will be driving the train, um, they should arrive here very quickly. Administrator, we now have enough data to analyze Piranesi missile technology. The associated research project can be launched in the tech lab. With this, we should be able to set up countermeasures to protect ourselves from Piranesi weaponry. New technology upgrade, missile threat analysis. Speaking of tech, the other thing that I want was... Uh, and this is also part of the recording thing, because I have forgotten what I researched. I think I researched the... No, I went to the steel mill the so that I could get bioelectricity. That's what I did. And after that, we are going to want the post-decryonization treatment. So let's queue up that. And now let's remove this road. And in addition to that, we are going to build a large stockpile there. Population transfer complete. Ice is being produced. This is very, very good. Time to empty out this stockpile. Even dis dismantle it. We should have ample... No, we don't have ample, but we do have a um, lot of power here. So let's build another battery. This time a tier 2 battery. Oh, this one isn't charged yet, so we actually do have ample power here. Three cycles already there at no... Not even 200. But then again, the farms are not powered on, so... Administrator, you can implement a new policy. I think you guys need to pick up the uh, alloys from here. Although th this is interesting. 
they are kind of doing two things at once. They are driving down with the alloys to that site while they are picking up stuff from there. Okay, we have picked up the uh, research, so let's go to P41 next. I should also launch a probe. As for the light bulb, I believe we can take the light bulb out of um, activity, active ships for now. This one should be set to accept carbon, whereas we should dismantle this one. probe has completed its scan and we also are going to start dismantling batteries in this sector because i have a few things that i want to do here as well the probe is done so yeah this is a good um little uh project we have going on here okay all of you guys are <laughs> the the bay is full let's uh, power on the electronics factory so we actually start using some that's how we can didn't I set that up tape? Didn't I? I thought I did. With that, we have unlocked the post decryonization treatment, which is also very good. Let's now remove this road, and we want to have another large stockpile here. Now, there is one stockpile I am uncertain about. No, no, I'm not uncertain about it. Now that I'm looking at it, I'm not uncertain at all. Farm is nearly done. They're taking their sweet time deconstructing this thing because they are trying to deliver before they bother picking up. Okay, now we can get the instant sterilization. Steriliz sterilization. This one is getting closer. I think we can speed things up a little bit. A side ship has arrived at its destination. Very good. Let's see what P41 has to offer. Crack P41 is a telluric planet with a small quantity of water present as ice. There are many large black telluric formations across its surface. The atmosphere of P-41 is heavy with cloud cover and storms envelop the planet, scouring it with solid aluminium rain. Eden has noted a formation of particular interest. Transmission from the Maxwell's team. This is the Maxwell team. We have landed near Site O. We should be protected from the aluminium rain here. We have located the formation of unknown origin and are commencing exploration of the site. Okay, let's investigate this formation then. They've finished the solar panel, so we don't need that one on there. Okay, so this can now take... Let me see here. I need to turn off food import into sector 1, and you can accept food, and you can be dismantled. Do we have enough alloys in this sector now? Let's power off the farm. Let's dismantle both of these. 
instant sterilization has completed so we do want the dedicated logistics PA as well to further increase the recovery rate and in this sector I do want a drone bay and I want it there and that's complete we will tear down this drone bay because we don't need that after that monitoring this regards to our workers here, I think we can actually turn on one of these farms now. How is things... Did I see angry somewhere? No. Things are progressing nicely here. How much housing do we have in this sector? 448. That means we can start dismantling domotic quarters. And we can also build the final farm. A science ship team has completed a task. The team, re the team reports that the Telluric formation is circular in shape and has steep sides. They have begun mapping the numerous tunnels that lead inside it. Initial reports suggest that these were not created by natural phenomena, but dug intentionally. Continued behavioral analysis of the team is registering, bre registering breaches of Dolo's safety protocol as well as metaphysical and psychological aberrations. One crew member appears to have removed their protective helmet, convinced that the air in the tunnels was breathable. Accounting for P-41's atmosphere, their remaining lifespan is estimated to be 37 minutes. And we got 66 science. Now we can do Naomi protocol here, which I don't want to do. Um, but just in case, the uh, Naomi protocol text there, the QLKHLQHYHU and so forth, it says Nihai never believed in this monstrous project. What we are going to do is we're going to continue exploration of the formation, implementing strict psychological monitoring. Did I turn waste? Uh, no, I didn't. Minimum. We need to export the waste to sector 2. We have the technology for the uh, health center, so now the health center is fully upgraded. Uh, some of these might be useful. Uh, we do need these three. They, these are kind of important. But let's just have a look here. I think the advanced sensors would be useful, actually. Um, not entirely sure at this moment. I do want the self-cleaning lubricant. So that requires the deoxidized contacts, yes. Uh, this docking bay is starting to get full, but at the same time, it's not a problem since the ice is being continually taken out. Our ships don't have anything to mine. Okay, the drone bay is done, which means we can dismantle the one here. Since we're drowning in electronics, I might as well continue to train colonists. Since they are using non-workers for it, and I don't know how many I'm going to need. 
probably go to 300. They work and function as normal colonists, and I doubt we'll need more than that. And then I can dismantle the uh, training center after that. Uh, the next thing that I do want in this sector here is... Uh, no, I actually think we have most of what we need here. We do need another uh, set of quarters. Because we are going to have more workers coming in here to uh, work at the farms. This sector is also progressing nicely in terms of uh, reducing our number of accident has occurred in the tycoon. buildings in the sector. Can I please click that? Thank you. That's 60. Okay, so I can't tear down another one yet. However, I can send some workers out of the, uh, the sector. So from sector 6 to sector 4, only workers 30. Probe has completed its scan. Send another probe. There we go. A science ship team has completed a task. Thanks to intensive psychological and medical follow-up, the Maxwell team was able to conclude the study. Solid aluminium particles carried by the winds of P-41 created the network of tunnels. The erosive process has transformed the topography of the planet. When the particles collide with each other inside the tunnels, their reverberation generates a low-frequency vibration. When this passes through the inner ear, it alters human neural activity. Let's leave the planet. This is going to be a bad idea, so let's collect the science and... Uh, Seek our luck elsewhere. Okay, now we want to build the medical health center in this sector. And that will basically serve as infirmary for every single sector on board the Tycoon. Um, so after this is done, uh, we can go on and tear down all of the infirmaries all around the place, which will save up some uh, building space. Uh, that thing is done as well, so let's do that. And we also want to build a third large storage in this sector. Population transfer complete. Very good. Um final thing that I want to build down in the corner here is a fire station. I don't remember what I wanted to build there. A probe has completed its Probably, scan. actually, probably another one of these. I mustn't forget the probes. I tend to forget them when I'm recording. Yep, we are going down on water in this sector, which is very good. Uh, here, we do need to power on the polymer refineries and power off the other ones. I think I'll stop them from picking up things. I need to uh, monitor this sector a bit closer. I've been very busy down in uh, the, uh, the um, new food sector, so I haven't paid attention. Now, with those three domotic quarters, we are going to have enough room for 336 people. I don't think that's enough, so we want to build another domotic quarters. And we do have the alloys for it as well, so let's do that. Also, research... 156 waste treatment center and then self-cleaning lubricants 
and after that let's queue up the hacking threat analysis. A probe has completed its scan. And to locate these resources is always fun there. We are not getting ice in quickly enough, actually. Uh, I'd also want to build a demotic quarter there. And we can dismantle two more batteries here, because I want to move the uh, houses up behind there. And yes, I realize that this might not be that exciting, but as I mentioned earlier, the reason why I'm doing this is because of the... Um, of the... Um, science events. I also distinctly remember turning off something in one of the sectors that shouldn't be open. Polymer. However, before we do polymer import again in this sector, I need to move the food to its own. Uh, it's going to be in here. Certainly lubricants done, so more power. A probe has completed its scan. And this one should accept ice. Send out another probe. It's a lot of silicon up here. I think we've collected the science, so we can go to uh, P51 next. However, we will have we have to deal with P51 in the next episode. What I will do is tear down these two demotic quarters now that we have the two new ones down here. Uh, we can also tear down the mess hall because we are done with a meal cycle. And this battery also needs to go. If the medical center is done, which it isn't, as soon as it is done, we will also tear down the infirmary here, because we no longer need an infirmary in this sector. Uh, what I do want to do is remove this section of the road, uh, so that we can build a stability modifier monument here, and I think it doesn't really matter which one we do. Um, I like the Lunacus Memorial. This space here is reserved for a water treatment uh, center, which is going to require a lot of waste if we ever need it. I don't think we need it, but it's a good building. Um, now we have 89 science. Uh, let's get these two, uh, the drone and the missile threat analysis as well, so we have those out of the way before I continue uh, doing research stuff. As for food, uh, we don't really need that much food in this sector. Uh, but let's have 80 food in the sector so that we have two cycles worth of, uh, at least two cycles worth of food lying around. Uh, and I also think we can power on the farms. 135. Okay, we need more workers before I power on the farm, the, the final one. Uh, we can take those from sector 5. A probe has completed its scan. 30, and we can also take 10 from Sector 6. And I think I'll want the rest to be where they are. Our science ship has arrived at P51, but we are not going to do that now. What we are going to do now is...
quickly check if the medical center is done, which it is, and then remove this infirmary up here and these bits of the road. And then in the next episode, we complete. will continue to work on the um, research events and also the restructuring and reorganizing of the sectors. We are almost out of water here, so this sector can very soon be torn down in its entirety. And I have no idea what I'm going to put here, but I'm going to put something else here because we don't need two food sectors. So for now, if you have any questions and or comments, then please do feel free to leave those down in the comment section. And if you don't have any of those, then uh, a little emoji down there just to appease the YouTube algorithm gods will, of course, be most appreciated as well. For now, I hope that you enjoyed the episode, even though it might be slightly uninteresting. I don't, I don't think it is because of all the science events. You can comment and tell me, but I do think you guys want to see the storyline. So, And I also hope to see you all in the next episode. That's bye for now.